Oh boy, English class. Okay. I can't just hands. This is generic. W. All right. Oh yeah, we gotta Ooh. talk to Orca boy. Orkeen sits at his desk with a crafty look on his face. I decided to talk oh, to him. Oh wait, Frank, that's that's uh, that's Trump. I decided to talk to him. More of concern that he's about to do something stupid, and less from genuine interest. Uh, I know that look, Orkeen. Uh, you're up to something. Oh, it's nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> Who's Orkane? It's clearly he? something. He tried to hide a smile, but it spreads across his weird, ochre thing face, despite his best efforts. Okay, I've been thinking about Maple. Now that she's class president for life, that means I can prank her with impunity, right? What's the point of a prank if you're not punching up? Wow, what a kind uh, of Okay. <laughs> Wanna knock her down a few pegs, the real whammy of a prank. Hit her right in the kisser. I just can't figure out how I'm gonna do it. Have you tried putting mustaches on her campaign posters? This is. Hey. <laughs> 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 <Yes. laughs> Don't do that. Burkin begins to cackle maniacally, enjoying the attention of everyone in the room. It's a little worrying, <laughs> to be honest. I like the way you think, Obama. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let me tell you about the recent conspiracies. It gives me an approving nod. I just gotta plan the dirty details. Uh, well, I'll leave it to uh, you, Orkin. Good luck. Froji. <laughs> Bench of you. <laughs> okay. One of his hands is clenched so tightly that his knuckles snow white, and his other clenched nearly as tightly. Holds a book. Alright, read faster. Some, we finally come. Uh, hey, Reno. I always knew this day would come. This faithful <laughs> final showdown between good and evil, liberals and conservatives. <laughs> <laughs> The light and dark are two sides of the same coin. <laughs> Me? I see the truth lies somewhere in the facts and logic. Now come, face my facts and... Yeah, I already said that. Rihanna suddenly tosses the book into the air and sits there, hurling down the classroom with a glorious spin kick. It crashes into the blackboard with a mighty crack! Uh, are we battling? A nice Jojo kick. <laughs> I'm grabbing the news, okay. The attendance chart! Time sees a slow down as I draw my fist back for my next attack. So what? So what? <laughs> The world. Stop platinum. Okay, well, this is just a little weird. Yeah, we're just kind of what the fighting. frick is even happening? Right. How do you pronounce that? <laughs> the book explodes. <laughs> Actually, I was just quoting the reading homework. Pretty dramatic stuff, huh? I like the part where they did the karate chops. And the debates. Oh, uh, yeah, the reading homework. Uh, of course. Karate. Man, that was the best book I've ever read. I love the fighting, the fury, but man, am I a man of peace. Uh, no kidding. Well, uh, peace out, Reno. Alright. Raster. Have we talked to Raster? Uh... Um, we probably did. We'll just, we'll just... Oh. Uh, big flame guy. No, not a big flame guy. What's cracking, hot dog? Uh, what's just, uh, just hanging out. Right on, that's gas, Cracker Jack. Me, I'm just riding those coping... Copycat <coughs> grooves, you did. <coughs> Say, sport, let me fly a question by you. Uh, sure, I guess. You on the hook? Uh, what? <laughs> you know, in love, you think of a dragon, any of these spring chickens to our homecoming shindig? <laughs> That's pretty forward, Draster. Uh, well, uh, maybe. Um, but I'm keeping it a secret. Or I knew. I knew it. A woo, no. Oh. Well, I'll can the lip. <laughs> Me? Oh. I'm playing it. Yeah, no, we, we've read this guy. We, we've read this dialogue, because uh, I remember this. Yeah. All right. Excuse me, pupils. Sorry for the delay. I'm sure we're all itching to get an English presentation. <laughs> English presentations. <laughs> few students snicker. Okay, so Whoa. apparently we figured out what you have we to do. just missed Jump Obama. <laughs> it's okay. We have that frame. <laughs> okay, that's fair. That'll be the thumbnail. Wait, can we... Okay, why does it not work now? I think you have to wait for the box to finish. No, it's um. Oh, never mind. Rivals direct. No way. That's funny. <laughs> I'm someone who looks like a weird version of like Simon almost. That's the creator. Of oh, I know it's. <laughs> I know it's Dan Fornes, but. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, the story, uh, like all stories, uh, begins with the beginning. And like all beginnings, uh, this beginning begins with... Uh, okay, yeah, so someone told me to get an A on the English presentation. You have to answer with what other people said. Uh, oh, uh, dojo kicks. 
after a grueling journey or you guys had to contend with. Overall, whatever. the moral of the story is... Oh, we didn't talk to the right people, I guess. Uh, the real treasure is the treasure we find along the that way. That was... The most creative interpretation. What? Wow, we get an A+. plus. I've ever heard of Obama. <laughs> well done. I, I would like to believe he talks like J.K. Simmons. Oh, uh, now, Silvos, uh, would you like to give your presentation? Would you like to give your presentation? I want a picture of Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Orkane, yeah, buddy. Okay. What kind of like, what is his jacket pattern right now? Uh, I think those are like legs. Chicken. What's up? And they walked down the hallway and suddenly oh, we started should... by a harsh whisper coming from the shadows. Uh, we'll, we'll look at that. All right. Oh, you're right. Psst. Wanna roll some bones with me? Ooh, is that a, is that a metaphor for weed? <laughs> I don't know. No, that, that's like rolling some bones. Like, you know how they say like, bones are like, Dollars. Then, then bows, then bows. So no, you're rolling up a dollar to smart oh. crack. Oh. Oh, you mean oh. roll some dice? I mean, I guess why not? You guess whatever it's gonna be below six, above six, or six exactly. You guess right, you get a brand spanking new gym sock. You guess wrong, and you're stuck with a consolation sock. If you know what I mean. Oh no! The Mom joke. found the consolation <laughs> sock. <laughs> uh, what's with the sock? Less chattering, more rolling. Oh, frickin'. Six, 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 six. Six exactly. Yeah. Wow. Okay, makes an uncares. Okay. Let's them go. Four. Wow, we No! It's a four. Don't fret, because you're leaving the <laughs> deluxe <laughs> Conchil the Constellation sock. Gives me the doom sock, which does nothing to console me. <laughs> oh, thanks, Orkane. Uh, so, uh, why did you want to roll dice so much anyway, Orkane? I'm not sure, Obama. I guess I just feel this overbearing obligation on my soul to corrupt everything and everyone around me. Wow. Has anyone seen a gym sock? <laughs> Proceed to third period. Oh, we get to play the computer lab game. All right. You want to well, stop it here? No, nah, we'll, we'll just cut this into two parts. Okay. It's not a marathon, it's a sprint. All right, well... I probably won't. Whoa. Ayala. Ayala. You're never gonna believe who. Oh, wait, uh, Orkane's in this class, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Is no Obama going to ask someone? Error, oh, it, it's, it's this college. guy. Alright, skip the dialogue. Yeah, let's get to the game. Fishy. Alright, so you're gonna. No, not, not. No, we gotta part of the Ben Shapiro. <laughs> 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 well, we're, we're doing Orkane this run. Okay. Alright. So, you, you read all game. How about that? Okay. <clears throat> Wait, what does he sound like? You just figured out. Okay. Oh, you know, Obama, a lot of people don't realize about me is that I'm actually really deep. Which makes sense, because I can swim really deep. So, naturally, I know about deep stuff. And now, it's just no secret that I love to prank. I'm a prankster. What? And a trickster. But I do it for a deep reason. I believe in the power of the prank. I'm a bit of uh, a pranking philosopher, actually. I believe that pranking is the key to a full and happy life. Pranks keep us lively. Pranks keep us sharp. Pranks make us appreciate what we have. Obama, <laughs> you ever shoot a geyser of water into someone's face? I'm talking full throttle, full blast, oh, no. fire hose power, watch them go and fly them back. They're terrified, they're disoriented. And then you go up to them and say, Hey, it was just a prank. <laughs> and watch the life return to them. They light up Obama. But there are even oh. greater pranking purposes out there. I believe in pranks as protest. Protest against this horrible system with cages all of us. A prank is inherently anti-establishment, is it not? Or he lives in this society. Anti-status quo, no. A prank takes the rigidity of the system and makes a mockery of it. A fine point to make. And I make it often. But beyond even that, Obama, what about our ultimate pranking purpose? Passing our pranks down. I ask you this, Obama. What is a family if not a prank that you pull on the whole world? The, whole, <laughs> the world is such a certain way. It demands a certain range of behavior. But behavior is learned. So you can have a baby. Then act like a pranking lunatic every day of its life. And it will think it's normal. And it will do that too forever. And your oh, will live on. What a shot! A prank of a person. Making a mockery of the world with not just their acts, but their every living breath. Someone so dedicated to the power of the prank 
could become a prank prophet. You see, on my more ambitious days, I am a bit of a prank pastor. A pranking preacher, if you will. Preaching the power of pranks by pranking every person I see. And I often preached about the one true prank that would unite us all. I've searched for it all my life. I've pranked in every way I can imagine. But still, it'll lose me. And well, well uh, there's still time. Time up! I, I literally did that like perfectly. What do you mean time up? All right, well, whatever. What's your name? Bradshaw, okay. Uh, probably not. I kind of based uh, the, the fish guy on uh, the Sicilian from The Princess Bride, if you can it's tell. It's fine. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Obama, can I ask you something? Oh, yeah, of course, Rester. How jealous are you that you can't fly? Also, uh, very... assuming a lot. What, what species are we? We don't even know. Uh, we're Obama. <laughs> we're so pigs in this pig pen have never tasted the stratosphere, never die bomb through lightning storms. Like we aren't even living in the same world, Obama. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. There's a drone strike joke somewhere to be made. <laughs> it's just a bird thing. Uh, which is it? Okay. <laughs> Someone told not. me Obama. I wouldn't can fly anymore for the rest of my life. All I would do is fly far, far away from that somebody. <laughs> okay. Proceed to your homerooms. How is everybody in our homeroom? What a day. Oh, man. Prize English test. I We literally are just like the ace of school. We got like a freaking everything. No, I couldn't pull it off. Just be myself. Be sincere. Be genuine. Sincere like Craig. Or maybe sensitive. Oof. <laughs> uh, oof. <laughs> okay. I'm just soaking. Yeah, that one works. Alright, so you and Bradshaw. Uh, Alright, <laughs> I'm just yanking your. Never mind. Alright. Rain. No, not Rano. <laughs> Orca. Alright. Mm. Ha ha. I ship you too. <laughs> I can't help but roll my eyes. Oh, the Orca kind of tell. I mean, the way you've been sneaking looks. Alright, well. Orca is at his desk, impishly fiddling around with some device. Surely for his last prank. <laughs> I must have all my courage and put a seat next to him, doing everything I can to hide my nervousness. Hey, Obama, what you up to? Uh, not too much. Well, actually, okay, that's a lie. Uh, I came over here because I wanted to uh, ask you something. Orkane grins a little and kisses his feet up on his desk, leaning back. Yeah, take a seat. As soon as I sit down in the chair, a rashious ploop sound goes off underneath me. I jump up and look at the chair. It's a whoopee cushion. <laughs> Presidential harassment. In the shape of a heart. In the what shape is of happening? a heart. Orkane doubles backwards in laughter, nearly falling out of his chair. It was a good natured prank. Almost sweet. Literally everybody Untouched. in this entire school is mentally uh, so, unhinged. Uh, does that mean you want to dance with me? Orkane shitters excitedly. Cutely. <laughs> Heck yeah! Heck I've yeah. been wondering when you ask. The rumors have been going around school all day. Uh, rumors? I mean, come on, you made it a little obvious. I blush and grin, and maybe I did. <laughs> uh, so, it's a date? Yeah, it's a date. <laughs> the Slippery Saga? Oh, no. <laughs> well, that, that was Lovers of Aether. Still, I'm not sure what I how to feel about this background image, but... <laughs> we don't even get to meet any of these characters. That sucks. Yeah, I, I would date I the owl. The I would totally... <laughs> Aiden... Well, at least I didn't choose a guy. This isn't a guy. Oh, I guess this isn't even an owl. <laughs> so you meant the guy next to him. The guy next to it's an owl. Oh, well. <laughs> whatever the frig this thing is. That's also a guy, but okay. That's a girl. Pretty sure it's a girl. Uh-huh. All right, well, well, we're not going to listen to the music all <laughs> the way. Okay, well, that was Lovers of Aether. We're not doing the rest of these. Only nine more runs. We can do it. Oh, my God. <laughs> We're gonna get through this whole game oh eventually, or the channel's gonna end. <laughs> Either one of those is gonna happen first. No, it's just like, they're the two in the same. <laughs> Alright, well thank you for watching. If you like Lovers Too Bad, it's gonna be a while before we do these again. Bye!